Hiya, are you alright? How are we this fine Friday? Lots going on in Nick's kitchen. I'm dead busy. What I'm on with now is, and it sounds atrocious, dump cake. I keep seeing it. I'll just put my phone down without losing you. So I keep seeing it on Instagram, Facebook, and it's literally, you put tinned fruit in the bottom of a dish and you get a box sponge cake mix and you pour that on the top and the butter that you would have put in it you slice it and put that on the top and I'm thinking surely that can't work but if it did how easy would that be everyone's got one of these in the back of the cupboard haven't they I mean make sure it's in date so let, let's see if it works nothing to lose so I'm doing a peach dump cake two tins of sliced peaches with the juice into the bottom of your dish and then all you do oh, can't, I won't be able to get into it I can't, I need a knife I've put my oven on 180 just because the cake mix box says 180 and then you just Sprinkle this over the top. All of it. Just even it out a bit. I mean, if this works, I'll be over the moon. So then just slice up your butter, however much it says on the packet, this packet said 90 grams, and just spread it over the top. It doesn't look enough to me, I'm gonna put a couple of more bits on. 90 grams didn't look enough to me, so I've just put enough on to cover the top then you put it in the oven the box said 180 so it goes in at 180 and we'll see how it comes out right let's have a look I have to say I'm not sure I would say it's, it's not a cake it hasn't risen but maybe it's more like a cobbler can't taste it at the minute because it's the temperature of the sun but I'll come back to it in five minutes when it's cooled a little bit right come on then let's have a piece so all the juice is thickened up at the bottom might not be that bad you know but it's still hot Oh. Oh. Sorry, I just put that out into the sink. I'm gonna have to have a good glass of cold water. Needs another five minutes cooling. Right, that was my own fault. My own fault for being too pig greedy. So let's see whether this dump cake needs dumped in the bin or whether it's alright. Give it a go. I do like how all that peach juice has thickened up. See, so because it's not runny. So look, it's been out the oven about 15 minutes. It was in the oven for about half an hour. You do need to slice the butter and put it all over the top because any bits that are not covered in butter stay floury. So you've got to cover it. Take no notice of how much butter the packet says. Just thin slices of butter all over the top. I think I've done damage to my tongue. Do you know what? It's not bad, you know. I would say it's cross between, it's not a cake, cross between a crumble and a cobbler. 
with some custard or ice cream actually mm. I wondered what all the fuss was about because I kept seeing it and every dump cakes galore with cherries apples you can any tinned fruit you like someone done cherries and pineapple um i just had tinned peaches but mm, no i can see i can see why they make it it's easy couldn't be easier and it actually is nice if you've now in for dessert and you've a, a cake mix and a tin of fruit go for your life I'd happily eat a bowl of that with some custard or ice cream, or even just pouring cream. Mm. Make it, give it a go. Absolutely nothing wrong with it. It doesn't look the best. But then, like I always say, you're not on Bake Off. We're not on MasterChef. As long as it tastes good, there's no rights and wrongs in cooking. If it tastes good, you've done it right. Give it a go if you fancy it. Peach dump cake. See you soon. Don't get to like and share. Bye.